Add split line. We can add this tool, uh, the split uh, a slab or a floor or a roof, and we can split it into different regions. So we can create a split line and we want, and we can adjust those edges uh, to be at different elevations uh, so that we taper the, the particular floor, or roof, or slab in, a, in any direction. So here I have a floor and some walls. I'm going to select, I'll go up to modify, drag a window over from right to left, and I'll basically do a crossing, and I'm going to eliminate using my filter and just get the floors. Now that I have just the floor, I'm going to go up to my shape editing. I'm going to say add a split line. And now it finds the floor. It has the boundary lines in the corners. Now when I hover over, it'll allow me to, it asks me to uh, click on a particular spot. So I'm going to click on this corner on this point here and I'm going to go all the way down and click onto this corner and now it's created at this point uh, and now I'm going to hit escape and now when I select on this edge you can see that I have an elevation here. I can either change it here or I can change it up here in the options bar. Um, but I can raise this thing up. I'm going to raise it up quite a bit. I'll go up six just for some exaggeration here. I'll hit enter. And so I raise a line from this corner to this corner up six inches in height. So it, it tapers down to zero inches here, tapers down to zero inches down here. And uh, so now I can just hit escape and I'm out of the command and I have a nice tapered floor in there and so a split line allows me to create each subregion I got these two different subregions I can grab onto this particular region here into this floor and I can then grab onto these corners and things like that and I can edit things by the when I go back in here and filter, I can say I just want to edit this floor. And this floor now has a split in it. And I still have uh, my corners here. I can gr grab all those things and play with them. Uh, I can put in points in here. Uh, I can um, you know, modify it by the edges if I modify my sub-elements, etc. So it, the, uh, the split allows me to split it into any type of a line to create subregions, which I can alter those subregions.